What's up, everyone, and welcome back to the Foxhole. This is KB. Thank you for tuning in. So today, um, I decided, I was thinking I was going to try to do another Reddit topic, but I just can't stray away from this MLM stuff just yet. It's too good. It's too exciting. I'm feeling it. It's feeling on topic. I'm going to go for it. So today, we're going to check out some good MLM um, r slash anti-MLM on Reddit. And I'm going to have a main focus on Unique today because Unique is just my number one. It is my favorite of all the MLMs to trash. It's just perfect and awful. All right. Stay tuned if you're interested. As a side note, if you are new here and or returning, I say that jokingly, folks. I know nobody is there yet. However, if there happens to be somebody there, please do this new channel a favor and hit the like button and also subscribe. That would really be awesome. I would really like to build this community and I need all the help I can get. So uh, help a girl out, folks. (laughs) Okay, so this is definitely... um, a really typical <laughs> unique photo um, they uh, <laughs> they put the mascara tube just under their nose to represent I don't know sniffing it they like the smell I don't know um, and then they look up so that you can really see what the lashes are doing but honestly you could have any mascara on and if you look up really hard it's gonna make your eyelashes look more accentuated it's gonna make the mascara look like it's doing a better job I mean angles baby angles um and can we also just stop and talk for a moment about how those particular eyelashes look a little spider leggy do i dare i do i do they are spider leggy but that's not her fault that's the mascara's fault um whoever this uh gal is i'm sure she's very nice i really like her nail polish um i wish her the best and i hope she got out of this (laughs) i really do i really really do Okay, so of course Reddit has served up a hot one uh, under r slash unique A-M-U-A. I'm not sure what the A-X-ray stands for, but anyways, uh, this looks like a gem. I'm excited. Here we go. Are you poor in 2019? Your fault. Join Unique. Can we chat for just a few minutes? It's 2019. There's really no excuse for being broke. There is literally a network marketing business tailored to every want and need you could possibly imagine. If you don't believe me, go research it. Hands. The only difference between you and those making six figures is a decision they made to face their fears instead of letting fear hold them back. I know a lot of people think that network marketing saying it isn't for me. Well, folks, being broke just isn't for me. <laughs> Shrug. Are you still doubting yourself? Doubting this industry? Ask yourself which is harder, staying stuck or breaking out of your comfort zone and trying. People spend thousands upon thousands of dollars and go so far in debt on a college degree, not even knowing if they will land a job. You can legit start your own business today for only $199. (laughs) While you're thinking of all the excuses why you can't, I'll be over here learning, teaching, inspiring, and helping others to see their full potential. I've got room for you. I believe in you. Heart, 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 heart. You know... Just the very level of smugness of these people, of these of these Hunbots, the smugness, the I've figured it out and you haven't, I know the answer and you don't. I'm it just makes me feel so ill. Like it's it's Oh, it's so hard to express that it makes the hair on the back of my neck stand up. Just Ooh, the smugness, you know? Yeah, I don't know if you remember, but the South Park episode uh, from forever ago. <laughs> this is really dating myself here. Uh, but where everybody buys Priuses, um, you know, because they're good for the environment and the smugness makes them, they, they end up farting all the time and they love to smell their own farts because they're so smug that their farts smell so good to them. This is what that is to me. This is what that is. It is just so blatant, so blatant. How awful. If you are on my pre-order list for the 4D mascara, you should have it in your hands any day now. Play around with it. Find what works best for you. But here are some tips from another Y peep. I'm assuming that means unique, unique person. <laughs> if you want to be on the second round of orders for the shipment coming in a couple weeks, just comment below and I'll get you hooked up. Okay, so let's look at this picture of the Y peep who's teaching us. And oh my God! <laughs> No! (laughs) Okay. (laughs) 
4D tips and tricks. Swirl your wand, wipe excess off. Don't try to get it in one coat. Be patient. Don't be afraid to layer. I do three to five coats. I don't even do three to five coats of nail polish. Twiggle, hell is twiggling. Start at the base, wiggle, twirl. Oh, I get it. A twirl, wiggle, twiggle. Oh my God. Twiggle from the bottom and the top. And I want you to know that there were more words. I had to cut them off. There was this many lessons on how to put on this mascara. Okay. I don't even know if I need to go into this too much about why this is awful. You can just take one look uh, and just know that this is awful. And I'm sure once again, this gal is probably sweet as pie and I hope she's doing well. And I hope she realized that that is not, oof, that is just, that's a wolf right there. Okay, this chick right here is the real MVP, okay? She clearly posted that this is not a parody and also made sure to acknowledge that this is her own handiwork from before when she was a unique presenter. <laughs> I just really appreciate the candidness of this and I'm sure she won't mind as she did post it here. So we are going to go ahead and just really talk about how terribly <laughs> that eyeshadow blended. And I'm sure that has very little to do with her ability or lack of ability. Um, I've heard this from multiple people who have used unique products. Their eyeshadow is pretty much crud. I mean, you can go to CVS and get a 10 times better product for <laughs> way less money, you know, Wet n Wild, uh, any of those, NYX even. Um, so just spending that amount of money on eyeshadow, you can't even get to blend. And let's talk about that eyeliner. Uh, I've heard from people before that the eyeliner just apparently runs. It When you blink, it moves. It takes forever to dry. And this would be a good case in point of that. <laughs> and uh, this girl is clearly a natural beauty. And this makeup is doing nothing for her. Nothing at all. I'm very glad she got out of it. Way to go, sister. Wherever you are, I hope you're rocking and rolling. <laughs> Okay, and here we have just another example of just what a wreck that mascara is. And you know, the thing about this mascara is it could possibly, possibly be okay if they didn't tell people to put on three to five coats. What is that? Look at that. That isn't cute. That isn't good. That is not any of the things that anyone's really wanting to go for at any actual point as far as their look goes. I mean... Oh, and you know, the, the facial expression too. I know that the unique people, it's these presenters, it's not their fault. I, I want to make sure to let everyone know that the, these people have been duped, okay? They clearly have been duped. And if, and if they are in the know, then they are obviously awful people who are okay with scamming others. But other than that, most of these people have just clearly been duped um, based on a lack of knowledge, perhaps. I mean, oh the looking up thing, the straining to look upward. I mean, it, again, it makes your eyelashes look longer no matter what you do. So I don't know. This is just a tough one. <laughs> it's just uh, rock on spider lashes. Um, yeah, you know, I mean, if you were going for a Halloween look, if you're really trying to do that spoopy punk rock kind of thing, I mean, this would really work. But just go into the office. You might, you might make your boss wonder what's going on with you. And we're going to round out today with a really nice conversation between what looks like a customer and unique corporate. I'm sure this is going to be very good. <clears throat> I do not have sensitive eyes, but I wore this mascara yesterday and I had a horrible reaction. Unique corporate. Hey, blah, blah, blah. I am private messaging you. I would like to get you taken care of, heart. I received your message via Messenger, however, I tried to respond, but it says you were not connected to Messenger. I have just messaged you back. I am not sure why it was showing that way for you. I look forward to assist you further. Hashtag unique customer care. <laughs> like that they hashtagged it. And then if you read the message below, excellent customer service. Thank you for helping resolve this for me. <laughs> the hashtag, hashtag unique customer care. Nothing was actually resolved. Instead of solving the problem, they just hashtagged it. I don't know. So maybe it bounces back to headquarters to whoever that person is who works for corporate. Gets like a free tube of that mascara or something as a reward. I'm not sure. <laughs> But the fact that this woman had to say, hi, this was bad for my eyes. I had a reaction and they just seemed to be dancing around the bush kind of a thing. Oh, sure, we'll help you. Oh, wait, the line, I can't hear you. Oh, I'm losing perception. You know, it's just one of those situations. 
Oh man, uh, pretty top notch. Uh, I hope that uh, gal who had the allergic reaction ended up okay, and I hope her eyes are doing well, and I hope she has steered far away from any kind of MLM makeup company ever again. And with that, folks, that's going to round out today's video on r slash anti-MLM unique makeup artist edition. That was a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please go ahead and hit like. And if you could subscribe, that would be the best ever. I'm a brand new channel, so any help I can get is awesome. Like the video, subscribe, tell a friend, and tune in again for my next video. Looking forward to talking to you guys some more and uh, discovering some more internet trash, some more gold. Have a wonderful rest of your day, everyone. Take care.